They're genetically really similar, 99.5% similar. And phenotypically, their, their morphology is also similar, only dire wolves are larger, more muscular, and have these light colored coats and other, other things that we can see from the fossils. And so we targeted DNA sequence variants that we believe lead to those traits. And then we edited gray wolf cells to contain those dire wolf DNA variants. And then we cloned those cells and created our direwolves. What they've done is use genetic engineering to make a gray wolf superficially resemble a direwolf, or at least what we think direwolves might have looked like, because we're not really sure what that is either. Um, what they'll probably never learn is, right, what is the finishing move of how you kill a giant elk or a, a you know, big deer, something like that. They're, those are sort of those finely tuned social learning opportunities that these guys won't have.